Welcome to Solid Camp Professor. I'm Sydney, your Solid Camp Professor, with one of many videos available to you 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. In this recording, we'll show you some of the new and improved options we have inside our whole wizard process. Let's open up our whole wizard process. And the first thing you'll note is that we can now see the descriptions next to each one of the processes. You can also see that we have more boxes underneath so we can add more and we'll see that in a few moments. One more option we've added over here is that we can choose from a different database rather than the default database that comes with this particular whole wizard process. Also, we've added one more feature of a pin to hold the defined whole wizard data box open. Let's see actually now how this works. If I were to click to pin it down, so if I were to go to my tapped hole, for example, and choose a tapped hole such as this one over here, it does the entire process. And after I accept it and it builds my operations, it brings me back directly to this window so I do not have to open it again. Now I can go ahead and choose a different one or choose tapped holes again, and this time choose a different tapped hole, such as this one over here. Accept that. And again, it'll bid the processes, and again, bring me back to this window. If I don't need this window open anymore, all I do is close it. Now, let's close this to go to our SolidCam whole wizard machining process. You'll note we have now a tab that will take us directly to the whole wizard processes. So let's open up the process itself and I'm going to choose one of the processes that I have here. What you'll note is as follows. We've added the option over here of being able to add another one, copy, and move any of these up and down in the order that I'd like to have them. You'll also note for each one of these process, we've also added a type. It can be either a counter bore, counter sink, simple holes, and tapped holes. Now, let's just take one of these, for example, and I'd like to make a copy. Click on copy, and we have a new process added over here, which is a copy of the old one. I can rename it. For example, I write tapped holes for aluminum and I'll save and exit. Now when I reopen my part and go into whole wizard process, you'll see that I have now a fifth one. And this of course could have been edited inside my process itself. For more videos on SolidCam Professor, please go to our website www.solidcam.com and look for our professor tab. Take care and have a nice day.